It's where we live and we've never actually been here before. Now you can say you had a hand in making some whiskey. Bottoms up. Welcome to Crestview, Florida. Yeah, this is our town and we've never actually been here before. It's where we live, so we figured why not check it out? Uh, Caitlin is registered to vote here. Um, our cars are registered here. New tags and registration. Thumbs up. Even our mail comes here. So much mail. And we've never been here. So while we were passing through the area, we said, you know what? Let's go check our town out. Crestview is a small town in the Panhandle between Tallahassee and Pensacola. It's home to a few RV-related companies like Passport America and one very unassuming building that's a big help to nomads like us. So the number one question that we've been getting over the past year and a half of full-timing is how do we get mail? Well, today we picked it up in person for the first time since we've been living on the road. <laughs> when we walked up, they're like, oh yeah, you guys have a lot of mail. So here it is. Our mail service is through Good Sam. They scan every envelope, which we can see on an app, and we have a few options. We can choose to have it forwarded to wherever we are, or they'll open it and send us a full scan, and they'll even hold it until we're ready to come pick it up. We've also called them before, and they've read us what we needed over the phone. It's a fantastic service if you're traveling full time. So much mail. One of the coolest things we found in downtown Crestview is this whiskey distillery housed in an old theater. The Fox Theater opened in 1947, but today it's home to Peden Brothers Distillery. Inside you can still find the old original popcorn machine and movie posters which now showcase whiskey labels. Blueberries were known for this area. We got to hang out with one of the co-owners, Robert Ellis, who showed us around and gave us a tasting. Oh, that's good. It should bite you. Yeah, Anything rocket, 80 and yeah. above will right. bite you up when you take a shot, but ours won't do that. And even let us make some whiskey. So what's this called when you do this again? Stirring up the mash. <laughs> <laughs> now you can say you had a hand in making some whiskey. If you come over here and smell, you'll smell a, like a strong beer. And when I stir it, you'll see bubbles just kind of rushing in. But it's still bubbling, so it's still making its alcohol. When this is done, it will all fall to the bottom, which we call the wash, and we'll strain this out. And we'll put it straight into the 100-gallon all-copper pot still. That's the thumper and the worm. We'll fire it up. It's like a, a water heater. And it runs through about four hours. We have whiskey coming out about 140 proof on the other end. And just like this classic theater, there's a lot of history with how the Peden brothers make moonshine. Their family recipes date back 200 years. <laughs> Bottoms up. We couldn't leave the distillery without taking home a souvenir. So we have these little airplane bottles. And one of the coolest things is these are plastic, which is great for RV life, but they do make glass too. Yeah, and each bottle actually tells a, a special story. So be sure to check out their website uh, to learn more about each one. And Robert, if you happen to be watching, thank you so much for showing us around. We had such an awesome time with you learning how you guys make whiskey. Yeah, and it was awesome to visit and explore our unofficial official hometown of Crestview, Florida. And if you're ever passing through the area, the campground at North Hurricane Lake is awesome. It's at the Blackwater River State Forest. They have several campgrounds. The one we stayed at was right on the lake. It was 24 bucks for water and electric. We got to watch the sunrise. Definitely uh, a great place to spend a few days. And if you like travel, alcohol, Shetland ponies, us, you should subscribe. <laughs> so like, comment, subscribe, and click that bell so you get notifications when we post new content. Thanks for watching.